Qatar Charity supports Afghan refugees in Pakistan. In collaboration with the United Nations Children's Fund, or UNICEF, Qatar Charity, a Shining World Compassion Award laureate, is set to enhance water, sanitation and hygiene, or wash services, across Afghan refugee camps in six districts of the Baluchistan province. The approximately $1 million US dollars UNICEF-funded initiative will help 178,500 refugees and their host communities over eight months. It includes ensuring access to safe drinking water, improving sanitation systems and hygiene awareness, as well as setting up wash facilities in schools and government health clinics. Furthermore, Qatar Charity and UNICEF's 22-month program in the Zheng, Nazirabad and Quetta districts will continue bringing further improvement to the health, nutrition and well-being of about 1 million people by establishing village and school committees as well as wash clubs along with training and educational campaigns. Thank you, Qatar Charity and UNICEF, for your caring initiative. May the kind Afghan citizens soon be able to return home and greet better tomorrows in Allah's all-encompassing love. Slower economic recovery predicted due to new COVID-19 outbreaks. A recent report by the United Nations Department of Economic and Social Affairs concludes that the surges of Omicron cases, supply chain disruptions, continuous labor shortages, and rising prices are hindering global economic growth. Compared to a 5.5% increase in 2021, the worldwide output is expected to improve by merely 4% during 2022 and 3.5% in 2023. In particular, East and South Asia's gross domestic product, or GDP, in 2023 is estimated to be 1.7% lower than projected before the pandemic. Furthermore, GDP shortfall predictions of 5.5% and 4.2% from the pre-pandemic time are foreseen for Africa as well as Latin America and the Caribbean, respectively. According to the analysis, sluggish growth in vulnerable economies will intensify poverty and social inequality while impairing sustainable development and climate progress. The United Nations is a laureate of the Shining World Leadership Award for Humanitarianism and two Shining World Leadership for Life Saving Hero Awards. Our appreciation United Nations Department of Economic and Social Affairs for sharing your sobering report. In God's wisdom, may benevolence be the foundation of our planetary future. California, United States Governor, announces housing initiative to support disadvantaged citizens. The Honorable Gavin Newsom recently revealed that there would be over 923 million US dollars in funding to build thousands of high-quality, affordable houses in the state. The homes will be constructed for people who are either already homeless or at risk of homelessness in the future. So far, the state has approved a total of 27 building projects to establish 2,300 units with 500 of them for those currently living without houses. In 2021, California allocated 12 billion US dollars to address homelessness and provide affordable housing. The Honorable Gavin Newsom is a Shining World Leadership Award for Loving Care Laureate and Shining World Leadership Award for Good Governor recipient. Our gratefulness, the Honorable Gavin Newsom, for supporting those most in need in California. May the day soon come when all human and animal people have sufficient food and shelter to ensure their lives are filled with peace and dignity in divine grace. Swiss scientists convert bio-waste into renewable energy. Professor Hubert Gihult of the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Lausanne and team have created a method of extracting hydrogen from discarded food sources after drying and grounding them up. The material they used included banana and orange peels, corn cobs, coconut shells, and coffee beans. The team utilized a xenon lamp's white flash of light as a high-power energy source to generate short pulses, causing photothermal chemical reactions and thus turning the discarded material into hydrogen and biochar, all in a matter of milliseconds. Both valuable products, hydrogen, can be transformed into eco-friendly fuel and biochar converted to fertilizer or used to produce conductive electrodes. Much admiration, Professor Hubert Gihult and team of scientists for your alternative energy findings. We pray to heaven that all humanity now moves to more sustainable and Earth-considered practices to protect our cherished planet. 
police officers in India rescue unconscious man. Andhra Pradesh policemen Y. Suresh Kumar and R. Satyana Rayana saw an unconscious elderly man lying near an intersection in the city of Vizianagaram. After checking out his condition, they gave him oral rehydration solution water. With the assistance of another officer, Satyam Naidu, they called an ambulance to transport him to a hospital. The Director General of Police praised the officers for their life-saving action on Twitter, while many people posted positive comments. A heartfelt round of applause. Officers Y. Suresh Kumar, R. Satyana Rayana, Satyam Naidu, and all involved for rescuing a precious citizen in need. May our vulnerable friends always be blessed with good fortune, peace, and love in God's abundant mercy. Vegan, tune yourself into the compassionate Universal Network. German vegan athlete endorses innovative plant-based meat products. World record holding strongman Patrick Babunian has joined German plant-based meat alternative company Greenforce to promote its Easy Mix product range online in the United Kingdom. It includes vegan pea-based burgers, mince meatballs, sausages, and fish cakes. Packed in powder form, the delectable high-protein and fiber items are created to have a long shelf life and greater sustainability while simplifying the supply chain. Consumers simply add water to just the right amount they need and then cook. Mr. Babumian, who has been a proud vegan for over a decade, starred in the eye-opening plant-based nutrition documentary The Game Changers. Green Force was established in Germany in 2020, and its popular offerings have been hot sellers in Northern Europe. Such exciting news, Green Force and Patrick Baboumian. We cannot wait to taste the delicious products. In celestial inspiration, may Green Force's pioneering creations help usher in a more radiant world of compassion. Humback well person saved in United States. Trained rescuers recently freed a one-year-old humpback whale person of the island of Maui, Hawaii, whose tail and fins had become entangled in 43 meters of mooring line with a plastic buoy dragging behind. The team approached the whale person in an inflatable boat and used a long plastic pole with an attached blade to remove the heavy gear that had started to cut into the youngster's skin. Each year, humpback people perform one of the longest voyages in the world of any person from the land or sea animal kingdom by traveling over 4,800 kilometers from Alaska to Hawaii for the winter. All praises and accolades, rescuers, for your successful life-saving efforts. May all whale people be healthy and protected as they continue blessing our planet with their immense vibrations of love in the gentleness of the providence.